premier event of the afternoon is the Golconda Derby Stakes to be run over a mile and a half, a grade one race. So we are here to see the previous runs of the contestants. Number one, Arrow Field. Number six, Indian Pharaoh. Number seven, Mark My Word. They took part in 2000 Guineas, which was won by Kof Kazel. Kof Kazel just came on the outside, kept wide, took the charge in the 200 meters and went off by one and a quarter length. Whereas Arrow Field, which is the final entry for the derby, finished a far away fifth. Indian Pharaoh ran second, ran a half race in the South India Derby, who were a mile and a half behind Psychic Force, just lost it by three fourths of a length. But it's marked my word, after having three wins in Monsoon, was given good rest, prepared well, tested in the first classic, that's a for the Colts, that is in 2000 Guinness, and directly has entered into the Derby. So everyone has to think of this horse, how it has been prepared. Big Brave, winner of two races in a handicap race, defied the penalty well. In the first run, nine points, and then that's for, now it will be trying his best to defy the seven points penalty for this 2000 meter win. Whereas Ulysses also came charging home, but Big Brave held on by three fourth of a length. Bradfield College is the one who started to chase That's My Magic when he got opening on the inside. But That's My Magic kicked on Gimli for a three length victory. Bradfield College was able to pull up by three fourth of a length better of the rest runner. Earlier, Bradfield College is a winner over a mile and we go to Egyptian Prince. This is the horse which gave 1,000 win to trainer Elvia Deshmukh. Look at the way it accelerates in the straight, went on a start to finish bit and was getting so stronger at the finish that even the rest of the runners could not even step on the shadow of Egyptian Prince. So back-to-back -back win for Egyptian Prince. On this note, the horse has come to the derby here. We have Golden Hind. After winning two races over a mile in Class 4, this has been entered from Royal Western India Turf Club, trained by Vishal Gaikwad. So he had last time Oaks winner through Bluebells. So he's confident that Hyderabad Turf Club is a lucky ground for him. We will go to Mystic Claim. This is the horse coming from Bangalore, trained by Parvati Bairamchi. This is a mile win which it had in race number 75 of Bangalore. So from mile, directly going over mile and a half, well bred. Turns out to be a steer because Mystic Dancer is a dam. Number 9, Ricky Tiki Tavi. Number 10, Treasure Delight are the two runners. Race number 74, where Ricky Tiki Tavi finished on 3rd. And Treasure Delight finished on 7th. This is the 2000 Guineas. We have seen this run with Kof Gardel winning it from Indian Pharaoh. Whereas Ricky Tiki Tavi ran on well to finish 3rd. After a couple of runs off the board, after finishing 2nd, in a million in Bangalore and third in the Colts Championship stakes in the Derby in Bangalore fifth. Then here the 2000 Guinness finished third by a margin of three lengths. Ulysses, race number 108. We are looking at Wave Rider. This is 94, race number 94, which is won by B. Sure. But look at Wave Rider who comes with a threatening run. I fell short of a one fourth of a length. Very consistent is Wave Rider who has finished thrice second over a mile, nine for long, and 2000 meters. Super normal. Any of this horse has been withdrawn. It's come from the trainer SSL Atala Yard. But this has been uh, declared a non-starter. And even the performance is wise. It has finished twice off the board over a mile. But winner that was in Mysore over a mile.